Let me show you guys how we literally set the stage on these brand new Dorchester condos. Marquis stays here, your favorite Boston real estate broker, Sony Brook and Lennox Realty Advisors. And today I am here with two of the best stagers in Boston. Actually, two of the best stagers in the world. <laughs> Let me show you guys how these condos were staged and they were staged by the best team at She Designs. I'm here with Therese and Shayna. And we're gonna walk through how Therese and Shayna set the tone for these new construction condos on the staging side that are for sale right now. So we got these brand new condos. I gave you guys a call, <laughs> open concept, ton of square footage here. Didn't know what to do. We already had a great product and wanted to make it better. Yeah. We threw the concept of how you guys put this together. Well, one, thank you so much for that grand introduction. <laughs> Um, so yeah, I mean, growing up in this area, we are really excited for the new construction and all the beautiful projects that are coming up. So when we walked in here, we were like, wow, um, beautiful, airy, open space with an abundance of light. And we really just wanted to just capitalize off the essence of the place. Um, the black and white fixtures, very important to showcase and just making sure that everything flowed. So when you walked in here, you know, it's not too matchy matchy, but right. everything flows. We wanted, wanted it to feel like a home, but we also wanted it to feel like a dream home at that. Or yeah. dream home. I wanted to move into what we were finished for the record. Exactly. So, you know, no space. There is so much space in here, but like no stone was unturned when we were walking through. We wanted to make sure that we showcase like every area, every unique feature of the place and um, you know, it impressed you. We also wanted to take a modern approach to the styling of the condo. Um, we used modern furniture. Um, we went with the black, a lot of the black and white mm -hmm. with pops of green yeah. um, because that definitely accentuates the place. Yeah, and, and I like, like, I like green as well because we need to sell these condos right. green. Green means money. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> So I, I love this penthouse condo through and throughout. However, this living room area where we have this nice open concept, mm -hmm. this, this living room area is one of my most favorite. And explain furniture, how you, you know, you, you set this up because obviously there's a ton of different ways you could have went about it. Mm -hmm. Talk to me about it. What we wanted to do because the living room is a focal point, um, especially when you're walking through this door specifically, um, we wanted to give it a wow factor. And so by doing that, we were very careful with choosing the type of couch we put in here. Nice. We wanted your clients um, to feel at home when they walk in. And with the couch, the accent pillows, and even some of the vignettes around, um, it definitely gives that home only feel. Definitely. So Definitely. that's what we were going for. And and, and one thing I want to actually throw in is not only does it, it it look great, it actually smells great as well. I remember I walked into the space and I said, wow, this smells like a spa. Yes. So I really yes. love what you guys did with that. It is important, especially when you know when you're dealing with new construction, you know, and also when people walk in and they see an open concept, they get so intimidated by the space. Yeah. And so it's very important to show them how much space they have. Like you have a dining area, right? You have a living room area. Um, you could set it up this way, and then you got your bay windows. You can watch the TV, and you can also be nosy and see what's going on with your neighbors at the same time. You know, but we wanted to make sure that. They were shown in just everything just tied in flowed together yeah so. you guys an amazing job <laughs> thank sure. you so we're here in the primary suite this current condo has 2500 square feet or so and it has one of the largest primary suites in the city um a ton of space to work with here how did you guys fill it in because it looks amazing so besides the living room, the primary suite is one of the most important spaces in the house. So, you know, we really had to just make sure that we utilize this space in every efficient way possible. Um, you know, 
bed over here and then you have your seating area over here and we wanted to use grays because you know when you're having a long day at work the last thing that you want to come and see is like red <laughs> and you know you want to yeah. walk into a space and just be able to have clarity and you know for your brain to say uh i'm at home and i'm in a safe space i'm comfortable you have your huge <laughs> uh primary closet over there which i mean it's like a little boutique in itself yeah. you know and then you have that beautiful bathroom with just an abundance of light uh coming through and so you know it's for us it's easy because all we have to do is envision ourselves here and say okay <laughs> well how would i want to feel when i walk into this space um so yeah we just you know put a seating area chose a couple of pieces and it worked out well love it so we're now in this hybrid suite it's another room in the home I remember walking through when the developer was actually building it and he was suggesting we use it as an office. The space is large. Mm -hmm. He said it actually looks like a bedroom. So when I called you ladies in, he said, help me kind of marry the two and, and, and do what you can do because I didn't know what we were going to put in here. So how, how did you bring this to life and, and sort of put a great picture on the canvas so a buyer can see, hey, this is what we have. This is what we can use the space for. So this room actually took a lot of thought. This was a challenge for both <laughs> of us. And I'll be candid with that. Um, and the reason being is because we first thought about just staging it as a bedroom. Mm -hmm. um, then we thought about just staging it as an office or a multifunctional room. Um, then as we were looking at the in our inventory and our furniture, um, we were like, why can't we just do both? Mm -hmm. So that's how we came up with the concept for this room. Um, we had our bed. We were able to fit the bed in nicely. You can tell that it's not overcrowded. Everything still has its own space and location. Right. We were able to put a little office nook over in the corner um, and a two additional seating areas. To us, it fit seamlessly, so it made sense. Right. Um, and we wanted the to give the buyers the feel that this room can be whatever you want it to be. And so we just wanted to showcase um, that in this specific room. Amazing, I love it. Yeah. Part of being one of the best listing brokers in the Boston area is making sure you surround yourself with <laughs> the best team. You're only as strong as your team. Um, for my developers, my clients, when it comes to staging, I make sure to bring in the best and, and that's everything, no matter what we do here. So when I work with my clients, we're a package deal. However, tell people if they're not working with me, how to reach you. <laughs> of course. Um, well, one, we want to say thank you for allowing us to work with one of the best, the best, excuse me, real estate brokers in the game, Cerise. Shayna, you can find us at www.shedesignshomes.com. You'll find our emails there and a way to get in contact with us. Um, our Instagram handle is at shedesignshomes. Look forward to seeing you. And there you have it, guys. She Designs Homes, Cerise, Shayna, best stagers in the game. Marquee Stage, your favorite Boston real estate broker, Stony Brook and Lennox Road Advisors. That's a wrap.